Hi everyone, Elaine here from Peace Love Scrap. Um, okay, you guys, I have the haul video of all haul videos for you. So, to be able to get it all in, I think I'm going to have to either do one or two, no, I mean two or three parts to this video. That's how much stuff I have. But I'm very excited to share it with you guys. And the first thing I'm going to share with you guys is the very much anticipated Amy Tangerine new line called Yes Please. And um, it just came out yesterday at Archivers. And I just so happened to stop in there yesterday, see if they had anything new from CHA. And they had the new Amy Tan and the new Dear Lizzie line. So I was very, very excited. So those are the two lines that I'm going to show you guys right now. And then um, my video, my part two video will be my um, February kit from Studio Calico and also my February kit from Ghost Summer Blue. I haven't even opened them yet, so I'll just do that on camera. And I'll show you guys what I got with that. And then there was one more thing. Oh, I finished getting the set. So now I have the completed set of the Spectrum Noir marker. So I believe I will do that in the third video. So as to not bore you guys, and that way if you're not interested in the markers, you don't even have to look at that one. So, okay, I am going to start out with all of the paper that I got from the Amy Tan line. And there's quite a bit. So just sit back with a cup of coffee and maybe a nice piece of cake because that's what I feel like eating right now. And uh, enjoy. So, okay, here is a sheet of paper. It is a 12 by 12 corrugated paper. Um, I don't know if you can see the corrugated lines in here. This is um, the only color that I saw there, but I really love this paper. So I'm kind of hoping they come out with it in some different colors. So this is like a pinky color, pink, it, pink corrugated, corrugated paper. Oh, can't even get that out. Okay, now we have another specialty paper by the Amy Tan line, which I absolutely love. It is this gray chevron, but the best part is it's, it's got this, the, um, what do you guys call that? The glitter, and it's like embedded in the paper. So, like, I can rub this all day, and I'm not going to get any glitter on my hands, and nothing's falling off it or anything. So, I think that's, I don't know, can you see the glitter on there? Ooh, that's a good one. So, this paper is gorgeous. And that's a 12 by 12 sheet. Okay, and then um, here's a sheet called Glimmer. And it has like this, you know, fake washi down here at the bottom, and then the rest is just plain gray sheet and then the back is this pattern right here okay and then um, this sheet is called truth so it's got that pink color again and then like this minty green color and these kind of I don't know what they are flowers doilies they kind of remind me of doilies and then this paper is called priority and I don't know if it's the name or these stripes but it's reminding me of like the airmail stuff so is that and on the back is this bluish greenish color with um, the little dots on it and then I really love this set or this paper sorry it's called um, trust and it's on craft paper but it's divided into these like I these are probably four by six size and then it's got the, the uh, ledger paper some lines I'm trying to see here that little card down here on the bottom card with that little city Here's a grid paper, some more lines, and then on the back is this really cute cloud pattern. Okay, and then this one is called Heart, and it's these little little houses and little towns. And then on the back is this green, almost kind of like a whitewash type finish on it. I guess that's what you would call it. And then I love this camera that she's using on her stuff. I love it. So there's this little heart camera. This, this paper is called Perfect. And then on the back side is this. I don't know what this is. I don't know what you would call this pattern, but I don't know. It reminds me of bamboo. <laughs> so that's what I'm calling it, my bamboo paper. All right, this one is called Thoughtful. It's got these shapes on it. And on the other side are these really cute whimsical clouds again that I absolutely love. All right, the next one is called Consistent. And it's this green. So obviously you're seeing the theme here. It's like a mint green, gray, pink. And on this side is this little, little town. Okay, this one is called Share. And again, it's almost like a little pinkish color. 
And then on the other side are all these little snippets here that you can cut out. This I think is so cute, this dog right here. I think he's so cute. And it says delightful, there's a little tree. Oh wait, there's the tree. Wait, where's the tree? There's the tree. Really driving you guys nuts. Okay, the next one is commit. These are the arrows. And then on the back is the gray with the white dots, polka dots. And then of course, I know this is silly, but I love every one of these little manufacturer strips at the bottom. Each one is different. So here's a yellow diagonal stripe. And then this one's called currently. This is another one that you guys can cut out. You could, these are perfect. So I think they fit really well into the Project Life um, page protectors. I don't do Project Life, but I know a lot of people like these little cutout pieces for that. And um, let's see. Oh, I love this camera. I think that's so cute. Live simply. I love this city. You can journal on this little tag. And then this one is called sentiment and it's got these words, word paper. And then on this side are little, little picture frames. Now, I don't know how many of you guys are familiar with the pure innocent stamp, the little pure innocent girl on, um, I don't know. I know my favorite thing sells her. She's super, super cute. Anyways, one of her stamps is her holding a frame that looks something like this and it says picture perfect in it. So I want to use that stamp with this paper because I think that'd be really cute. And then this one's called Play and I love this sunshine and cloud in the in the corner. And that's all that's on this sheet. And then there's this really pretty floral pattern on the other side. And this one's called Understand and it's this green ish blue chevron. Although the camera's picking it up it almost looks kind of gray but you can see the color here with the light it's more in the green family. And then here's this really pretty bright yellow with these white clusters on it. And then this is called Reflect. It's just got pretty flowers up at the top corner and then at the bottom corner. And then this chevron type, I guess it'd be a chevron pattern on the back. And then this really turquoise blue with the white dots. And then this gray pattern see it. It's a great pattern here on the bottom. And of course, again, another manufacturer strip. Okay, so now I'm going to show you guys the embellishments that I got with this line. I think ugh, I killed it at the store, man. I bought so much stuff. But I've been saving my money for these two lines, so I knew what I was going to spend this money on, so I'm glad I got it. But okay, she came out with this stamp set. She usually has the, um, the roller stamps, like here's one. This is one that she had put out before, and then this time she has this wooden one. But at the bottom is all these different lines, and then it comes with, I'm going to try and open it. it, comes with a calendar on it and then all the months of the year. So you just peel off one of these and slide it onto the bottom of this to use as your date stamp. So, I don't know, I liked it because it's different. The only problem was... It was $17.99, but I used my 30% my 30 off coupon on this at Archivers. So, I don't know, I thought that was kind of expensive, but... Okay, and then I got these... I'm going to open these up so you guys can see them because they're really cute. They are these um, wood veneer tags that go with the line. And, again, like I told you guys, I am in love with this camera. And then this one, you know, I... I I have to figure out a way that I can reverse this so you guys aren't looking at everything backwards. But it says, let's go somewhere fun. And then there's this floral pattern. And this one says, enjoy little things. Enjoy the little things. And then there's the little, the little town. So, I don't know. These are really cute. They actually smell good. I know, that sounds weird, but they do have a smell to them. Anyways. Okay, moving on. All right, then I got the stamp set. I don't normally get the stamp sets, but because I am incredibly in love with this camera right here, let me get a solid piece of paper. It might help you guys see it better. Okay, that helps. Or maybe it doesn't help. No, that doesn't help. Okay, anyways, here's the camera, and then it has the ampersand sign, uh, floral, 
like a grid, the arrow, the little town, clouds, another arrow, a little house, a little love tag. Anyways, I thought they were really cute. And again, I'm in love with that camera stamp. And I believe this set was, it wasn't that bad. What did I, I don't know. It was like $8.99. So it was like half the price almost of the, the stamp. And then I got the um, die cuts, the die cut shapes. You can see them in there. They're really cute. Um, let's see, it comes with a couple cameras, some flowers, some journaling spots. Here's that really cute dog, isn't he cute? The tree, I love the tree too. Okay, and then um, the sticker book that American Crafts has been doing now with the last several lines. Um, each line comes out with like one of these little sticker books, which I think are really cute. And they're really convenient because when you're done with them, you can just flip this little lid up here tuck it in it's kind of like a matchbook and that way everything stays nice and safe and it's easy to store too so I'll just flip through these real quick in case you guys haven't seen them yet like obviously all this stuff goes with the line and then uh, okay this says um, sweetness daily routine you are funny um, noteworthy, day in the life, where's that one? Day in the life, remember, hello. These really cute clouds. Again, the tree, little journaling spot, says city girl. And what does that one say? Oh, be kind, little heart in a frame. And I think that's the last sheet. Yeah. So I like those. And then, um, okay, this is something new by Amy Tan. I have not seen this type of product out yet, um, but it is these templates. And on the templates, there are the little, you can see the little holes on there. And those holes are to be pierced with the paper piercer. And then you go through with a needle and thread, and you can sew the shape onto your paper. So I think these are really fun. It says love, it's got an arrow, flowers, the feather that everyone seems to be using, the cloud and the sunshine, see, and the little city. And it came, so it came with two templates, a little piercing pad. This is, uh, this is like a five by five. And it also came with three different embroidery flosses. It came with the green, the yellow, and the pink. And then let me show you the other template real quick. That's out of my way. Um, and the, these templates, these were $8.99 for, for them. They both came in a package. So there's the camera, little heart, arrows. Um, she also has an alphabet one, which I love. The alphabet one is super cute, but archivers didn't have it. So if they ever get it, I'll probably grab that one too. Um, and then you just sew on your page with it. So I thought that was pretty cute. And then again, here are these little puffy, puffy stickers. Um, here are, these are like almost vellum type stickers. So these are pretty, these would be pretty on some cards. Um, I got the six by six pad. And then last but not least, I got the three different kinds of thickers that came out with this Amy Tan line. This one is um, printed chipboard, it's called Goodness. It's that like bamboo stuff again. And then here's black. Uh, what's the name on this one? It's called Wish. These are the foam letters. And this one, and this one is called Sincere. And these are the gray stripes, which I think these are so, these are so pretty. And I like how all three of these are different fonts. They're not the same. They're all different. And then also I got this because I thought it was fun. It's a big sticker. Uh, it's a big, I don't know, letter stickers, but... There's quite a few on here. There's pink, the mint green, the gray, and this orangey yellow. And um, 
there's how many? There's 448 letters in here. So I thought that would be kind of nice. Okay, guys, so round two, we are going to do the Dear Lizzie line now. Okay, and this line is called Lucky Charm. It is super cute. I will start with the papers first. Okay, this one is called Rainbows. These little uh, envelopes with hearts on them, and then the back is just a green and white stripe. Almost the same green as the Amy Tan line. And then this one is called... What is this one called? Wishbone. Kind of looks like, I don't know what kind of pattern that is. <laughs> and then on the back is these, these these anchors. I'm not crazy about this side, but I really do like the other side. And then, oh, there's no manufacturer strip on these. Oh, on some of them there are. Okay, I love this one. This one's called Junk Drawer. This reminds me of like a flea market. I don't know why, it just does. But you can cut these out in strips. And then on the back is this um, pink triangle. And then this one is called Float Away. It's got that really cute hot air balloon in the, in the corner. And it says, you'll never know, dear, how much I love you. And on the back is this really pretty yellow in white polka dot. And then I love this strip on the bottom. Isn't that pretty, that flower strip? And then here's another line. It's called, or another paper. It's called This and That. And then again, these are the little pieces that you can cut out and put in your page protectors, the four by six page protectors, or I don't know what size this is. It might be three by five. Anyways, it says you make my heart sing. And then on this side is a pink constellation paper. Not really sure if I'd use this size side, but it's cute. Okay, and then um, the next sheet is called Collector. And this is really pretty, um, like a beigey cream stripe. And then this is just a plain piece of pink on the back. And then this one's called Lucky Coin. And again, it's these more journaling spots. You can even use them as um, photo matting too. And then on this side, I really love this side, little hearts on it. I think they're so cute. And then this one's called Raindrops. Perfect for spring coming up. Got these umbrellas, and then on the other side is these really cool stripes. And she's using a lot of navy in this line, and I'm really loving the navy. You don't see that too often. And then this one is called Bright Bobble. And it's got this pink fade, as it fades from lighter, or goes fades from darker to lighter, I should say. And then here's another navy pattern with the pink triangles on the back. And I think out of the whole line, this is my favorite paper, this piece coming up. It's called Pretty Poppies. I think it's so pretty with that navy background. And then here's like a red and cream stripe. And then this one is like a red and pink, red background with pink polka dot. And this one's called Doting Dots. And here's ledger, like a ledger. I don't know, maybe that's not a ledger. I don't know, looks like it, I guess. And then this one is called Little Trinket. And it's got all these little words on here. I don't know, it says like, collections organized by color, storybooks, dresses, shoes, bracelets, art, flowers, just a whole bunch of little stuff. And then there's this floral pattern in the back. And then this one is called Noteworthy. This one's cute too. A bunch of little arrows on it with the different patterns. And here's some more ledger type paper. And I think this strip down here at the bottom is really cute. See that horse? It says um, wild thing. Wait, is that what it says? Yeah, wild thing. I think I love you. So I think that's super cute. And then here is something called novelty. And it's this little pink paper with these little cream horses on it. It's so cute. And I don't have no idea what you would, what pattern this is, but it's almost like a purplish blue. And then this one is called Falling Star polka dots. And then there's this little words on the back of this one. Then this one has got um, the pink sheet music and it's called Blue Skies. 
and then with the words on the back. Then this is called Stargazers, and this is another constellation page, except this time it's cream, like a gold and cream. And then here's some stars on the back. And then, of course, anytime you have a Dear Lizzie line, you have her jars. So this one's called Dream Catcher. And here are all the jars. And on the back is just mint green paper. And then here's a vellum sheet of chevron. And then this one's called Starlight, and I love this page too. It's just a really pretty navy polka dots. And then this triangle pattern on the back. Okay, so I'll try and get through here real quick the um, embellishments for this line. Okay, I've got the 6x6 six six paper pad. Um, and then here is the sticker book for the Dear Lizzie line. I'll flip through it real quick. That says love. A laugh is a smile that bursts. <laughs> um, you are awesome. The little heart says you on the bottom. High five. This one says you make my heart sing. Florals. And some more. Okay, there's one more sheet left. There you go. That little umbrella is cute. What does it say in there? It says, you make me happy when skies are gray. Okay, and then I got these because I love using the label stickers. And then there's the side too. And then the um, chipboard shapes. You can see them in there. I'll show you the back. So you got the jars, that really pretty heart. Um, some journaling spots, different words, what does it say? Happy, story, oh so lovely. And then I thought these were cute. These are these these are little cutouts and there's going to be a color on one side but I'm going to flip it over so you guys can re actually read it. <laughs> but it says, you make my heart sing. So the words are cut out and like this is on orange. And then this one is a navy blue a navy blue floral. Let me see. Oh, so you can see the cutout on there. And then this one um, is little arrows. Let's see if you guys can see that. Little arrows. And then this one says, um, this is my happy place. You just have to punch the, uh, the letters out. Um, here's one with hearts on it. Here's another one that says a laugh is a smile that bursts. And what's this last one? This last one says high five. So you can see here. You would, oopsie, one just popped out. So I thought those were really cute. I've never seen anything like those. Oh, and those are four by sixes. They're four by six. So it's like, oh, and then here's another one. It's pink and it says hello sunshine. And then I love these. These are the um, the chipboard, printed chipboard um, stickers. I love the little horse. You got the um, banners at the bottom. This is lovely. Got the umbrella with the raindrops. Did a couple different banners. And, yeah, but of course there's more stickers. And then a little mini alphabet at the bottom. I think that's cute. And then I got the three set of thickers that came out with this line too. Um, they're called Charm. And they are in uh, like a, a tan, a black, and a pink. The only problem is that they are all the same font. It's like that cursive font, which is fine. But I liked how the Amy Tan lines, all three of her thickers that came out were um, different fonts. So, I don't know. I, li I like that, but... Apparently it didn't stop me from buying them, did it? So, all right. So I hope you guys liked um, the two different lines. And uh, if you have any questions about them, just let me know and I will get back to you. All right. Have a good night, guys. Bye.